Ladies and gentlemen, the Coppola show down right here on your 89.7 FM. And uh, just like I mentioned, we'll be having uh, something special coming to you. And uh, Kantu just dropped uh, a track a couple of uh, minutes ago. And uh, we have it right here. Hello? Hello? Yes, good evening. How are you? Oh, good afternoon. Ish. <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon. I'm fine, thank you. How are I, you? I'm uh, just fine. How is Lusaka? Lusaka is hot. It's really, really hot. No, but not but hotter than okay. the copper belt. No, I think <laughs> I think Lusaka is worse. <laughs> okay, it, it's been some time, Kantu, and uh, I remember we were chatting about I wish at some point uh, the song that you yes. just did and features a T-shirt. Uh, but now you've yes. dropped a fragile heart. A lot of people yes. uh, thought that maybe you've, you stopped doing music for good. W w what's behind that? Are you still doing music or what's the story? I'm still, you know, um, I'm still doing music. And sometimes um, I just have a problem with the way our um, certain people just um, convey certain messages mm -hmm. from, you know, the, the person that is putting it out. I did not say I'm quitting. Okay. Okay. I said after my last album, um, like this will be my last album. So it doesn't mean that I've, it was with immediate effects. You get the difference. Yeah. So it meant that I'm still doing music up until I'm I'm done with the with, with, with the brief album and I'm done with the promotions and you know everything is dead. Once that album is it's completely sold and I've exhausted all the music I made, you know, quit. But you, well you, are you saying you may, are you are you saying you may or you will quit? Well, even at that point I think I I will be done. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I will quit, I will no longer do it. But after the backlash and the cries from the from my fans, I figured Maybe it wouldn't be wise for me to deprive them of the beautiful music that I do. So, <laughs> so, so then why, why yeah. did you even consider stopping music uh, altogether? Well, I'll be very honest with you. And most of these things came out after death, uh, death, uh, death, may God rest his soul. Mm -hmm. Most of the things that I was feeling, most of the most of the things that were making me feel like I think this is not lucrative for me anymore really came out and a lot of people got to see them right after death. death. Our industry is not growing the way it should grow. I've always been telling people we need to advocate for policies because once, our poli once policies that govern the industry are, have been set and certain laws have been uh, made and implemented, I think the industry, then only then will artists get what um, what is due. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. A lot of artists put in so much work, but people would rather contribute money to come and bury you and not pay for a song. They will put up my hundred kwacha, my five hundred, to come and bury you at your funeral, okay? But they will just never say a one one quarter fifteen way to buy your phone. So okay. there's so much and now there's the issue of Pakra, there's the issue of Zanko. Okay, so what you change mm. like there's it's it's a lot there's a lot of things that are not right and I feel like we are not addressing them and as a result a lot of artists are becoming a little bit frustrated because they're not getting what is due to them, what is old to them. Okay. Interesting. Um, yeah. we, we, we might draw on that a, a little bit more maybe in the future. <laughs> but then we'd just like to find out the message uh, behind yeah. the fragile heart. Is it the message going to somebody or is this the song that you wrote at, at, at some point? Well, I wrote this song a long time ago. I actually wrote it in uh, 2018. Okay. I wrote it in 2018 and, you know, as, as a woman, as an adult, there is so much that you go through, especially when it comes to relationships and whatnot. So I wrote it at a time when I had gone through so much in terms of relationships and I I sat down and I did a deep introspection and I got to understand the type of person that I really am, you know? Okay. So I, I just found out that I was I was the type of person that is 
when I love, I love beyond measure. Like, you know, okay. Nima Kondelela. So, <laughs> when I wrote that song, I was in that space where I was heartbroken and I was just thinking, you know what, if you're going to come into my life, you better be truthful, you better be honest, because when I love, I love. But if you're not serious, you don't, you, know, you don't intend to stay, you might as well just not come anywhere near me, because it, you're going to end up breaking my heart. Interesting. Good. Congratulations when you're married. Thank you. <laughs> and so, so does it, is it safe to say you're no longer, uh, you know, fragile, or maybe you found the person that you know is that's for you? I found the person that is just meant for me. Um, I, I found the perfect person for me. So it doesn't matter whether I'm fragile because he, he's just there to just strengthen me. He. He's always there to hold my hand, even when it gets, even when it gets rough, even when I feel like I'm down. He's just there to just lift me up. So I wouldn't say that I'm, I'm no longer fragile, but I'm, I'm saying that I found the person, the right person, to just take care of me in my fragile heart. <laughs> okay, amazing, Gandhi. I'm sure you 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 have another fan somewhere, somewhere. Just because uh -huh. of what you said out there, and I'm sure a lot would go. You want to, you know, be in your position, and uh, you know, you are somebody yeah. that you know a lot of people look up to. And we just thank you very much for coming to you on the show. And this is an amazing thank piece you very that much you've for come up. Sure. Okay. I'm sure, we'll be having a, you know another 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 okay. interview very very soon uh, with uh, you know, the dropping of singles from your album and uh, the official okay. drop of the album itself. Okay. Thank you so much. All right. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. Okay, bye. Okay, so that was Kanto, ladies and gentlemen, right here on Coppola's number one hit music station. Remember, Coppola Rider will be coming to you just in a bit. Number one for all your hits. Number one for all your hits. The Coppola Showdown.